<laughs> and the rabbi got so pissed that I spoke Swahili from the Vima, he refused to do my wedding. Our bar mitzvah is basically like a wedding, except not. Rite of passage into Jewish adulthood, and by Jewish adulthood, I mean absorbing as much humiliation as you can possibly absorb in like a three to four hour period. A bar mitzvah is like the best party ever, but it's wasted on 13 year olds. You read from the Torah, you give a speech, and then there's a big party. So that's me. Stop it. That's my sister, oh. and that tall man is Rabbi Gold. That's the party. Holy. Everything's, everything's gold. I feel like you're still smiling through the pain. So here's me on the chair. See, I never got lifted on the chair. They even bother, they lifted my parents on the chair. This is my two younger brothers on the wait, chair. Wait, wait, at your bar mitzvah? At my bar mitzvah, but they did not raise me. You just look like a classic Jewish kid. Except two feet smaller and very confused. My grandmother had passed away like a few months before my bar mitzvah and my best friend's grandmother, who I'd known my whole life, she was there and she was like, I'm, you know, I'm here in her honor. I'm your surrogate bubby. She was 75 at the time. She made out with my DJ on the dance floor. <laughs> you look like Ron Weasley. So here's me in this chicken hat that I wore like all night. And my dad like kept begging me to take it off, but it's in like all the pictures. So here is me and my dad and my mom, my two brothers. Mm -hmm. You are looking super 13 right there. <gasps> this is me. Oh my God. There's just no way to take a non-awkward photo at a bar mitzvah. I want you to be my son. <laughs> <laughs> this is like a pre-exposed titty shot. Up on that chair, man. Janet Jackson has nothing on my mom. Both, both ladies. Oh my God. Okay, every boy in my seventh grade class. <laughs> Sorry, mom. You have a nice rack, it's fine. And afterwards, I asked my mom if I could just take my best friend on a cruise. And so we went on a cruise with my best friend. So you had a of honeymoon a instead of a bar mitzvah. <laughs> I just want to point out that we are exact opposite bar mitzvah kids. I only had a bar mitzvah so I could have a party. I didn't even really believe in Judaism. And they didn't even have Pinterest back then. Oh, wow. So how are you supposed to plan a freaking party? Yeah, what's terrifying to me is that I have a six-year-old daughter, mm. which means that I only have seven years to save for this shit. They're expensive. Overall, I feel like bar and bat mitzvahs are, I mean, they're a rite of passage, but I feel like at the time you don't realize that. Yeah, I don't know. I did it for the party and it was a great party. And I'd do it again for the party. Yishmechu v'malachutacha shomre 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 shabbat b'chorel.